Hi, my name is Francis. I've been associated with chocolate my whole life. 20 years as an employee and 5 years doing my own traditional business. Uh, but today, I'm here to tell everyone I'm very glad to be in New Skin and I can experience the true taste of freedom. I grew up in the 60s, in the Beatles era. I was a very jovial kid playing music with friends. Uh, I played badminton as well. Just like any Malaysian, I, I worked very hard when I started to work. Climbing the corporate ladders, uh, overcoming many challenges. And I climbed actually from a management trainee until my last position was a chief operating officer in a public listed company. In 1998, when we have the Asian financial crisis, it really hits a lot of companies in Malaysia. Scaling down operations and closing down divisions is inevitable. Unfortunately, my company was part of it and uh, I could see many colleagues uh, lose their job. I mean, it was very sad to see people leave to think what to do next. They have families to feed. It was not a nice uh, experience, actually. After 20 years in employment, I find that my time with my family is getting lesser. This is actually not what I wanted in my life. So one day, when I went home, I told Lillian, my wife, I said that uh, I think it's time we probably start my own business. Owning a chocolate business where you are the boss yourself, uh, many people will say, will tell me, oh Francis, you look good, you're going good. But in fact, if you look at the details of owning a business, uh, you are actually exposed to a lot of things that are beyond your control. Workload has uh, becoming more and there has been a lot of uh, social activities, you know, a lot of entertainments and somehow it has started to affect on my health. Uh, I was diagnosed with high blood pressure and high cholesterol, which the doctor has put me on medication for 10 years. Uh, it was one evening that my niece, Michelle, came to me and said, Uncle, we have this program that can help in your health issues. My niece felt that I, I have to go through this program. She faces a lot, a lot of rejection from me. I hated MLM. I looked down on these people, you know. But because of she's my niece, and I said, uh, okay, why not I give it a try? After 90 days of program, my health was, uh, you know, I see a great improvement and I become more energetic. And, uh, and some people say I, I became younger too. I do attend a few uh, of the trainings conducted. Huh? It was quite tough for me in the beginning. The training was conducted in the language which is foreign to me, which is Mandarin. Because I was uh, English educated from young, I did many ways to learn. And I also do a lot of recording. I will take a lot of photos or pictures of the slides. Uh, when I reach home, I will ask my wife. Classroom training is one thing. In fact, when you try to have the practical part of it, example, when you start to meet prospects and trying to share them the goodness of these products and, and business as well, it was something very uh, challenging to me. After many, many continuous uh, mindset trainings, uh, I managed to somehow overcome this I'm very happy through New Skin. Uh, I regain my health. Uh, I have more time with my family. Uh, we can do a lot of things together. And I am become a more jovial person now. I'm, I'm very health conscious on whatever I do, whatever I eat. And I actually share with many friends that uh, to do the right things. And this is a Mandarin phrase I learned in my first two years in New Skin. Since Pinuli Tong Yao. It's like a, a, being a force for good. This is in line with New Skin Mission, that we continuously go out and help many more people to change their lives. I do not know what I will be uh, if I'm not with New Skin today. And uh, I believe everybody deserves a chance to understand uh, what or how New Skin can change their life. <music>